Have you ever seen some weight loss TV program where some contestants lose a big amount of weight only to gain it back almost right away? Ever wondered how and why that happened? It's all because of the yo-yo effect. What's the yo-yo effect? Yo-yo effect, also known as weight cycling, is the cyclical loss and gain of weight resembling the up and down motion of a yo-yo. Losing weight quickly by doing a diet plan, then regaining it falling back into your eating habits or failing to stick to your exercise routine will lead you towards the yo-yo effect. A classic yo-yo dieter's weight goes up and down but rarely stays in one place for long. People who do diets without consistency tend to fall into a vicious circle. After each weight loss, the weight regain that follows is worse than the previous one, which then makes them diet even more severely than last time. Such a yo-yo effect can lead you to put on more than 20 times of your normal weight, or worst case, obesity. So, what are the causes? Number 1. Too difficult diets. A diet plan that is too restrictive to follow over a long period of time. Number 2. Overexertive exercises. This causes burnout and difficulty to keep it up in the long run. Number 3. Unbalanced diet. The same nutritional mistakes will be reproduced a few weeks or months later. Number 4. Extreme dieting. This causes depression and fatigue, resulting in difficulty to sustain the willpower to continue. The common reasons of yo-yo dieting seen above are what drive yo-yo dieters to eating more than they would have before dieting, causing them to rapidly regain weight. When psychological factors kick in, it's almost impossible for dieters to sustain their willpower. Therefore, old eating habits and lack of exercise cause fat and weight to bounce back as much or even more. The yo-yo effect is dangerous. Why? Because the regained weight is increasingly difficult to lose. Imagine you're struggling to lose 10 pounds, and now you have to lose 20 pounds due to the rebounding weight. Anyone will go crazy. Rebounding occurs because our body remembers the effects of deprivation caused by secessions of diets over a long period of time, therefore resulting in storing more fats in reserve to prepare for future diets. It is a progressive development of obesity. Your weight will bounce back in an extreme manner, and the recovering process is twice as difficult as the previous diet process. You'll feel out of control and lose grasp on the long run, thus resulting in a rocketing weight gain leading to obesity. Besides, emotional distress leads to depressive disorders. The suppression from previous extreme diets are bound to cause you depressive disorders like insomnia, depression, dysthymia, bipolar. Such disorders will interfere with your daily life, affecting your normal functioning and cause pain to you and your loved ones. Thus, you'll have a higher possibility of having high blood pressure, high cholesterol, gallbladder disease, or cardiovascular disease, arteritis, infarction, etc. Inconsistent food intake, unbalanced nutrition, on and off extreme exercise workouts, and emotional instability will eventually drive your body haywire. Your body won't be able to familiarize itself with all the changes done within an inconsistent time frame and manner. All of the above dangers will eventually lead to the possibility of a shortened lifespan. There's nothing wrong with being ambitious and eager to achieve your ideal weight. Having the desire and the drive to meet your goal is half the battle in getting there. Be flexible and learn from your mistakes. If you try an exercise regimen or a new food plan that you don't enjoy or find hard to sustain, then try something else. Bear in mind that your goal should not be to lose as much weight as you can or as quickly as you can. You need to establish healthy patterns of eating and exercise that'll help you lose weight while at the same time having long sustainability. You need to realize that trying to do too much too quickly could be your undoing. Be realistic on the amount of changes you're able to make at once. Keep track on your progress and find sources of support as it'll be helpful for you to overcome difficulties. Exercise buddies are great and some people find a lot of value in the support they get through online communities. The most crucially essential factor in solving the yo-yo dilemma has to do with changing your behavior. Practice eating smaller, more frequent meals. Plan your food intake. Include hunger-fighting protein at each meal and snack. Plan ahead, keep track, enlist help. A quick sprint might get you to the finish line if you're lucky, but chances are you're going to be left exhausted and out of the game. When it comes to successful weight loss, slow and steady definitely wins the race. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.